say that if x y equal to a b a plus b and x y plus y square minus x y equal to a cube plus b cube, then we want you to find y of x over a minus y over b times x over b minus y over a. But just read this is not enough to think. All right, let's think with me together. So in this case, I would tell you the hint to solve this problem. Okay, that's the hint. Hey, why I get this and why I bring this? Because these rational properties, it's related to x, y plus plus y square. It's something that we know. Related to x and y, something that we know, right? Okay, so since x square plus y square equal to what? Equal to a cube plus b cube. So I would take this into the other side. So I get x plus plus y over there, it plus sign. So when I plus it, with the other two x y, so I get three, right? I get I could get three x, I could get three x x y. But since I know that x y here equal to a b time time a plus b, so I could represent this in this case. So now I could make into the other properties a plus b cube. That's the formula, right? So and I take the problem to to define. That's the problem, the unknown, something I want to find. In this case, I break down through, okay? So I break down through. So the information here that I get from something that I that I write down here, okay? That I write down here. I know you already know this. It's, it's pretty simple, right? Okay. After that, I make into a square because the information we know that is a square. And I take it minus 2xy here. Okay, so if you plus two of this together, remain the same. Okay, remain the same. And in this case, it's put it just the same time. Okay, put it the same. So in this case, just I highlight the circle for you. It's because I just, you know, it just a minus and this one I make it add more. Okay, this one I add more. So, um, in this case, why I could get x plus y square, I could get a plus b cube. Because in this case, right? Because I want this. See, I know that this, why I try to bring down this because of this, right? Okay, so I could represent x plus y square equal to a plus b, b cube here, okay? Over a, b, put it the same. And see, I know that 2xy here over a, b minus x, um, over 1 a square plus b square and just use it normally. In this case, you know that x, y equal to a, b time a, b time a plus b, right? So I could simplify a, b out, okay? You just, you know, take the value and represent it and you will get this. Just think in your paper and you will get it so, right? Okay. After that, it's pretty, technically, it's very simple in there. So you could just simplify this in this with this, right? Is that true? Yeah, okay, it's just pretty simple in there. So you get it zero and that's the answer. Therefore, the answer is zero. Okay, so if you still not understand about this, I would recommend you to comment in the comment box below and I will try to explain you in the other new ways, okay, if possible. Okay, thank you for watching. If you enjoy watching this video, don't forget to click subscribe in order to get more free man outstanding videos.